rise and shine. It's boulder, boulder time. Oh, man, come on, go. Getting you a little behind the scenes today. All right, let's rock and roll. Boulder, here we come. With the, in, with the injury and all, it feels like I have not awoken for an early morning race or run in a long time. Feels good to be out before 5 a.m. Oh man, there's nothing like waking up for a race morning. And let's just hope this strap holds for the bike. And yes, uh, basically, I'm gonna do my best to scoot around this 10K course. And don't quote me on this, but I believe this is the second or third largest race in America. Uh, the Boulder Boulder 10K started in the 70s. Huge 10K, huge crowds on Memorial Day weekend. And of course, we remember those who gave their lives today uh, so that we can be free, at least in the United States. Uh, I know there's a lot of people watching outside, but that's why we're, uh, yeah, that's what we're celebrating and remembering today. So. I just want to mention that at the beginning. So the Boulder Boulder 10K coming at you. Let's see if I can get around on this bike and make sure this strap holds up there. Oh man. All right, I'm taking a little bit of a risk. I The race starts in 90 minutes. So I think I have time, but keep in mind I am in a boot and I am going to be pedaling around on a bike. But I want to try and get some shots of the flat irons. And you might be asking, what are the flat irons? These are huge rock formations just outside of Boulder uh, to the west. So they're beautiful, they're big, the sun is rising. I'm gonna try and get some, capture some beauty for you before zipping down to the starting line here in Boulder, Colorado. All right, but it's risky because uh, time is of the essence, but I think we can do it. All right, here we go. and spectators are also expected to cheer them all along. While runners begin the race, rain or shine, just before 7 a.m., the Boulder Boulder is, of course, much more than just a race, with events into the afternoon. Boulder Boulder also including a Memorial Day tribute, including the presentation of colors, a 21-gun salute, and the playing of taps, as well as a flyover with military skydivers. Just a quick check in. We are at the five mile aid station at the Boulder Boulder. 
There's at least, I think there's 55,000 plus runners here. It's crazy, it's the 41st annual running of this 10K race. I think the only other race that's a little bigger is the Peachtree 10K in Atlanta, Georgia. I believe that's the only other big, the other biggest race in the United States. It's just so fun, a lot of good energy out here. People cruising, rocking, it's just insane. So many, ah, uh, so it's fun to fun to see everyone uh, roll through this aid station. All right, there you go. Oh, uh, getting the shots, getting the shots. I got my workout for the day. Oh my goodness. All right, that was a little behind the scenes of the Boulder Boulder 10K, and I'm gonna say it right now. This might be a little controversial, but it's definitely bold. The Boulder Boulder 10K finishing for the elite field in Folsom Field is, I, I'm calling it now, is one of the best, uh, most energetic, loud finishes for elite runners in the entire world. Have you ever watched an Olympic 10K? Sometimes the crowd size can be a little wanting, unfortunately. This crowd, and I don't remember how many uh, people can fit into Folsom Field, I'll look that up for you. I think it's at least 50,000 plus. Now it wasn't 100% full today, about 90%. 
That was unbelievable. I can't believe how loud it was. And I've been to a lot of football games in that stadium, and it wasn't louder than a football game, but it was approaching a football game uh, volume because everyone, as soon as they enter the stadium, is just going bonkers. So anyway, amazing. If you ever get a chance to run the Boulder Boulder 10K, I would highly recommend. All right, let's get back to, back to the house. Go catch my breath. Go get a drink. Drink. All right, let's go. So here's the deal. The last clip that you saw was filmed at noon today, uh, Memorial Day, May, is it the 27th? I don't even know at this point because I'm very, very tired. That was nine hours ago. I just returned from a Memorial Day uh, barbecue and now it's time for bed because I woke up at 4 a.m. to go uh, film the Boulder Boulder today. It was amazing and uh, usually here in the studio, I set up the nice lights, but this is what the studio looks like with uh, just normal lighting. So I gotta go to bed, so I'm not setting up the nice lights. I love you all. Keyword, boulder, but which one? You get to choose. That's right, you get to choose which boulder down in the comments for the, the keyword and the question of the day. What was the last 10K that you raced? Maybe it was the boulder boulder today. Uh, for me, frankly, I think it was last summer at, summer at the GoPro Mountain Games in Vail, Colorado. So that was my last 10K. And yes, I did make a highlight reel of the Boulder Boulder. Go check it out, upper right hand corner. It's a good little five minute motivational video, if you will. That's it, folks. I'm tired. I gotta go to bed. I love you all. Thanks for tuning in to a little behind the scenes filming of the 2019 Boulder Boulder. Seek beauty, work hard.